A long time ago, a curse was set upon Harding High School in the shape of a night. It was placed in a senior patio where the seniors ate during their lunch. Blah, blah, blah. That's the story every freshman got when they first walked through the doors. There was once a story about uh, a curse that was set upon Harding in the shape of a night that if you stepped on it, your whole high school year would be filled with bad luck and despair. I didn't believe that curse one bit. And whenever I saw that night, stepped on it, sat on it, jumped on it, did everything I can to try to like make the curse fall upon me. The first time I stepped on it, nothing really happened. I jumped on it and stayed on there for a while, but nothing really, nothing happened actually. So I knew those people were lying about the story. I guess it took a little while for the curse to actually happen. Because uh, I guess I went to my locker and then I, when I opened it, all my stuff came tumbling down. It was like a freaking meteor storm. Still wasn't enough to convince me though. The curse just had me alive. And during my next year at Harding, I heard about a new curse. That if you stepped upon the night, then you would get stuck inside a room with the soul of the night. Come on guys, it's not cool. Open up! It was pretty scary, actually. Every year the curses would change. From bad luck to like trapped in a room. Now this year, it's getting chased by a night. How fake is that? It's all fake, it's gotta be fake. Can't have all the curses, have all curses on it, right? Well, it turned out that the ch night was real, so I got chased all over school. During my senior year, I heard that the seniors are safe from the night curse, but then I also heard about the new curse that year. The curse said that if you stepped on it, you would disappear forever. That's gotta be a joke. <laughs> 